<laughs> well, Jared, he's, he's, he didn't even speak to uh, the doctor or anything like that, so I just can't... St Kilda's fourth win from their last five starts. Revolt from the 50. Kick on its way. Is good. And the Saints should be home now. Top four position. They'd have to win all of their matches, I suspect, but uh, it's not beyond them the way they're playing. Oh, how about that? There's your highlight for the night. Aaron Fiora, terrific goal. Tripping the light, fantastic there. Nice pirouette. And the finish. Come on, Rod, give us a smile. There you go. What's here we've seen in a number of situations tonight? Clinton Young, looking at the physical side of his game. He's had a couple of great efforts, but the flip side is there's a couple of efforts where he just needed to be a little bit tougher over the footy. And that one there, he had Aaron Fiora cold in a tackle then. Fiora a 17-point win against the second-place Hawks. Max Hudson celebrates game number 200. Luke Ball brings up victory in his 100th. Robert Harvey celebrates. Well, just another game. 14 11 to 11 12, our final. The Saints are only percentage, it would appear, out of the eight after 16 rounds. Well, it's a comprehensive win by the Saints, and uh, at the start of the season, I think most pundits had uh, the Saints in the top six and Hawthorne somewhere in the middle six. Well, right now, the uh, positions are reversed, but there's still a long way to go in this season. The Hawks really got the challenge for them, uh, for yourselves now, Jason, to go back. You've had a couple of. Uh, uh, an ordinary month, I reckon. You haven't yep. played your best footy. You've um, got an option now of uh, really falling away or restocking and hitting the finals in top gear. It will be an important test to see if they can bounce back, won't it? Because they've got a tough few games coming up. Luke Ball, terrific tonight. Finished with three goals and plenty of the footy. Here he is with Rowan. Well, uh, Luke, a, a terrific win tonight. Starting to find some momentum towards the end of the season. Yeah, that's right, Smithy. Uh, you know, we, these guys got us last time and we know they're... I mean, they were second on, second on the ladder coming in, and we're out of the eight, so these are the games you've got to win, and, uh, yeah, the boys ran it out really well, you know. Hawthorne are a fantastic running team, and we knew that we had to run it, run it right out until the final siren, and, yeah, we did that. The one thing that you did tonight was shut their run down totally. Is that something you focused on during the week? Yeah, it is a bit, yeah, and, and, and to be honest, we, we played in a similar way to we did earlier in the season when everyone called it the worst game ever, but uh, the, tonight we, didn't, we, 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 we played the same sort of strategy, and... And, uh, but, you know, probably we were able to run it a bit more out of the back line and link it up through hands and, and uh, we're probably a bit smarter with our entries into the forward line and lowered our, lowered our eyes a bit more and that's why we're able to kick 15, 14 goals. Well played tonight. Terrific win. Go and enjoy it. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Ryan. For all the talk about Luke.